Hey you guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Jessica and I created Delta by J. So in today's video, we have a swimwear review. So I am going to be reviewing the very famous, very popular Triangle Swimwear brand. They have over a million followers on Instagram and I know a friend who loves their bikinis and she told me that after three years, it still looks great. So I was like, you know what? I kind of want to try it out. I want to try something different. I've purchased a couple of really luxury bikinis lately, but I find the price point for these aren't too bad. I have two styles. I'm going to review them and then also include clips where I've tried them on so if you're here for it give the video a thumbs up and keep watching this is called the maya honey sparkle set from triangle and it has a little bit of a cheekier bottom and it does have a triangle little logo on the back but it is all matte black so if you're someone who hates logos it's not a really big issue it's not an issue for me and i just love the color of this so it's really really nice this kind of sparkly swimwear texture is a very very trendy i'm noticing so i opted for it one of the photos on their instagram it looked absolutely super hot super sexy and it was just like really cool and kind of sporty looking so i was into it give you an idea of pricing by the way i believe both of the sets i have here were 99 dollars us so it's not like a cheap swimwear brand but it's not like super luxurious like something from like fendi or something like this you know what i mean so this is the top all done up so it does have adjustable straps and then also a clasp in the back one issue i have is i could not figure out when i first got this how to open the clasp like it's fine to push like you basically push from the back but one thing i'm noticing that is the same issue as with my zimmerman bikinis that have this type of closure is because there's a matte paint on it it has already like little chips just on the clasp like it's so subtle and you can't even see it because it's you know facing the way that it closes but just something to point out like the paint is kind of already chipping off a little bit but it's in areas that you can't really see but at first i could not get this clasp like undone i don't know why it was just so tight so i literally just put the top like over my legs and pulled it up to figure it out that's just how it closes you can't adjust it unfortunately so if you don't pick the right size it might be too tight on your back section so with this set and both of the sets I have, they have like a really, really awesome responsive online chat. So you can message them and they literally reply to you immediately. And I just said, this is what size my um, chest is. What do you recommend for me? So I got this in a size small plus. So I think they have extra small, extra, extra small, extra small, small, small plus, small plus plus, and then they have medium and then large and then extra large. So it was kind of confusing to figure out you know, am I, should I just order a large? Because I typically order large tops by default. Usually small is just not going to work for me. But because of this closure, I was like, if I get a large and it's too big, I'm going to be screwed because this doesn't adjust. So in the chat, they said based on my cup size, I should get a small because I'm like a 32 double D to E depending on what brand of bra I'm wearing. So I was like, mm, small, I don't know. With the model on Instagram whose boobs looked amazing in the photo, she apparently was wearing a small, but I was like, still... I feel like it's not gonna cut it so i got small plus and i will put like snippets of me trying on the bikini etc and as you can see like it is still kind of cutting it like i could have got small plus plus even medium uh one thing i do notice with the size across my rib cage is that it does kind of dig in a tiny bit at the back it's not so bad that i'm self-conscious and i feel like i have like the back fat situation happening because it's just so tight but i do notice like it could be a little bit looser so i think if you're anyone who has the same cup size as me i would definitely do small plus plus or medium because i'm still like i have no issues with this top but there's definitely like times when i'm coming out of the pool i've tried this in the pool i've done the pool tests and everything and i'm like oh i hope it doesn't go down it feels secure though the fabric is not flimsy at all it stays up and it cuts in the right places like it doesn't feel like it's like really digging into my skin which is good the only complaint i have is with this kind of material okay i have a missoni bikini in this same material and the Missoni version is much, much, much softer. I find this to be very kind of rough. It's not the most comfortable fabric, just FYI. I don't find it's actually too bad around like the bottom area because especially like the bikini area, this can be like irritating and not fun at all, especially if you have sensitive skin. So I don't find it too bad on the bottom, but I do find is 
with the back of it, if you're kind of laying against a lounge chair, it can kind of dig in a bit and feel uncomfortable after a while because the material is kind of like, it gets scratchy and the straps. I find the straps, they really just kind of scratch the back of my shoulders a bit. I still am gonna wear it though. I still like the bikini. It's not so uncomfortable that I'm gonna return it and I hate it, but it's just something to note. The texture of this material is definitely not as luxurious as my Missoni bikini. I mean, it's probably like, four times less the price or five times less the price even than what I paid for that bikini. Let me just show you. So just to give you a comparison in quality here. So this is a bikini from Missoni. Absolutely love it, okay? Absolutely love it. But the price, it was a splurge, okay? So this is a Missoni bikini I have. I'm gonna do an upcoming vacation edit. So I haven't really talked about this yet on my channel, but this is honestly so soft. It does feel a tiny bit abrasive. Like it does not bother me whatsoever. This is honestly such a comfortable bikini. I've worn it so many times because it's comfortable. So it's kind of like this, really cute. But the quality of material is honestly, I hate to say it, it's night and day. Holding these together, this feels like sandpaper in comparison to Missoni. But once again, this is 99 US and the other one is like, like at least 400 or 500 something. It was a lot, okay? So the second set is definitely my absolute favorite set. I love both of these sets though. The second set is called the Mala set. So similar in name. And this I think is absolutely fabulous. This is the top. How fabulous is this? I only have, I think one other bikini with molded cups. It's my Zimmerman one you saw in my far fetch haul, I believe um, a month or so ago. This is absolutely gorgeous. I've gotten so many compliments on this bikini. I love the ribbed texture. Like it just looks expensive and it is very, very much like a Bottega green. Like on the camera, it might look a bit darker, but it is very much that Bottega kind of green. It's not a neon, but it is that green. And I did do the online chat as well, just saying what size should I get? And I think they told me I should get a small and I'm so glad I didn't listen, to be honest. I got a medium and even the medium is like cutting it. Like I could have got a large easily in this, but I do notice drastically difference in comfort against my back and my rib cage in the medium. It, there's no like pulling or anything. The small plus in this one, it is a little bit tight. That's just one thing. So I think my size, if you're 32 double D kind of range of chest, I would do medium at least in this brand. But I do really like how it has these spaghetti style straps. You can adjust them as well. It doesn't give you really intense tan lines like at all basically. And they're really quite, you know, they're secure, they're strong. And I do like the molded cups. I think it just looks a little bit more expensive, a little bit more bougie for a beach or pool day, you know? One thing I do notice is that for whatever reason, the finishing kind of like my Zimmerman one, I don't know if this is a cup bikini issue. The threads are kind of like, just loosening a little bit. I've already had to trim them a little bit here. I'm not sure why this is happening. My Zimmerman one has the same issue, but it's really not a big deal. It doesn't show when you're wearing it. And then once again, there is this back closure with this matte green clasp. And I'm not noticing the paint coming off on this for some reason, but again, I had the same issue taking it off. Like you literally just press it from the back and it opens, but I don't know why putting it on at first, I was like really struggling. I don't know if it's because it was just freshly manufactured, it was stuck, but I'm not sure. And the bottoms, I opted for the cheeky bottoms, by the way. So these are the bottoms, really, really cute. They have the same kind of matte black triangle logo and that texture. I just love this green. I think this is so beautiful. Green is honestly like my color. I think I just look fabulous in green or blue, but I don't find enough blue clothing items that I love enough to buy. So I always just get like green things, but I really, really love this so much. This set is gorgeous and it has these really cute like string ties and then these kind of like matte green details there. If you want like a really high rise bikini, this will not be the style for you, but I think it works fine for me. I really love the style. I like how it's cheeky, but it's not a total thong because these bikinis are like kind of skimpy enough, you know? So yeah, really beautiful set, really beautiful. The other thing as well with this bikini company is that you do get these neoprene cases for them. So the green one comes with the green and then the Amaya Honey Sparkle comes in a black one. And by the way, this green set here which i've gotten so many compliments on this color is called tropical and just by the way guys i'm so sorry i need to give you a better rundown of the sizing so this is a medium top 
and then I got a small bottom and I'm always between a medium and a small bottom depending on if it is a string tie or not. If it's not a string tie, I find usually medium is what works best for me. But in the case of triangle, I actually did a small bottom in both of them and totally fine, no issues. And then once again, small plus in the top, I kind of wish I got a medium or a small plus plus, but Hope I'm not confusing you with all the sizes. But anyways, yes, you get the neoprene bags. I think this is awesome, especially, you know, if you're at the beach and you want to change out of your bikini and put on, you know, dry clothing. You don't want to be in a car going home with like a wet bikini on. And you can put these in your bag and they'll kind of protect from your items getting wet and really, really sturdy. You know, you could put like sun lotion in here as well. Put some things just in like a beach bag. Some beach bags are just like basket bags, right? And you just throw things in. It's nice to have something to just like put your personal items in that's just like a quick little pouch that's not just out in the open. So I like that you get those totally free of charge as well. So far, my experience with this brand has been really good. They have some really, really cute styles. They have some terry cloth swimwear as well. I really want to try more, but for now, I think I have like enough swimwear going on. I'm just trying to enjoy these ones because yeah, I've got a lot of bikinis, but I'm really, really happy with this brand. Let me know if you guys have tried it. Let me know if you guys have any other bikini brands and kind of like the mid-level range that you absolutely love as well. And I would love to interact with you. So definitely leave me a comment below. If you guys enjoyed the video, if you found the review helpful, give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing for more fashion content. Okay guys, take care. Have a great day. Bye.